Oh, oh, I forgot you can't even see my outfit. And I actually wore a dress today. Okay, so I bought a Polaroid camera, a Hello Kitty Polaroid 600 camera about two months ago or a month ago. Wait, no, it's September, so like almost two months ago. So I actually wanted another Hello Kitty camera that was sold out and I thought it was gonna be sold out forever. Like, I, I don't know, I thought I just wasn't gonna be able to buy it and then I saw this, this beautiful camera that I, I really do love and I, like I, oh, I forgot that every time you flip it, it, the film, I don't know if you could hear it, there's like a noise. I love this camera so, so much and honestly, I don't know, I think I mentioned in the last video, I would probably collect them now, like Polaroid 600s because I think they're so cool, especially the different designs and stuff. So the camera that I originally wanted was released in the 90s only in Japan, so it never got released here in the US. I I really wanted the camera, it was sold out. It was also way more expensive than that camera and I mean, like I said, I really like vintage Polaroid stuff, so I was willing to shell out, you know, a couple of hundred. Yeah, it was sold out and I was like, okay, whatever. And then I saw this camera and I was like, oh, this is so cute. Like, this is awesome, I love it. And then, like, two weeks ago, what came out again is that damn camera that I wanted. And I was like, really? Really? Well, I bought it because, I mean, I couldn't not buy it. I'm not even gonna lie. I, for like a few days after I saw that they were in stock again, I was like, no, I don't need it. And then I was like, but like, I kind of want to collect them. It's not just because I want that one. I want, you know, I I mean, I don't know how many Hello Kitty cameras are out there. Hello Kitty Polaroids are out there, but I want all of them eventually. Yeah, I just kept saying to myself, like, I don't need it. And then I was like, but like, it's part of my collection, my ongoing collection, apparently, that I'm doing. Yeah, I bought it and it is right here. Oh, oh my God. Why? Let's do that again. And it is right here. Vintage 600 camera. Pink strap, very cute. Actually, it kind of goes with my outfit. I'm wearing pink today. Oh my god, I like how I'm twirling around like you can see what I'm wearing. It's just a freaking dress, it's not a big deal. If you saw my last video, I completely did not know the whole exposure situation. Basically what that is, is if you're in like a dark place or a light place. So if you're somewhere where it's really light and bright, and you wanna like, you know, take a picture without it being so bright, you can just put the exposure towards the darker side. And then the opposite applies. If you're somewhere really dark and you obviously want the pictures to come out like you have a face, then you put it towards the light. And then if, you know, you're somewhere where it's normal, like if you're outside and it's just, you know, natural, natural daylight, you just leave it in the middle. Or like in here, I, I would just leave it in the middle. So that was my mistake in the last video. That is very cute. All these films apparently have like a cute little quote or saying or something. I think the last one was like, what happens in Vegas? And I was like, yeah. I'm gonna take it right here. So exposure is in the middle. Yeah, that's good. Wait, what is this? Whoa, whoa, wait, what is that? I think there's something. <gasps> oh. Close up lens switch. This is what happens when you do that. You pull the lens, you see the lens. So that's cute, but I guess I'm not gonna mess with that. Wait, let me fix my hair. <laughs> I don't like it for the camera. Oh, wait, oops. Okay. Let's pray that this comes out okay. If it doesn't, then it's just me. Whatever. This is taking forever. One eternity later. Okay, so it's not fully developed, but my arms, like look, you can tell that I'm taking the picture. I'm trying to see if there's a timer on this. I don't remember. I feel like there is not. There's not. Two thousand years later. Since I've been gone, I've taken five pictures, two outside, three in here, because after the first two selfies, I was like, why does this look like crap? 
because they look so blurry. Like, they just look blurry. Look, I don't hate, like, how I look. I mean, it's not even about me. It's just, like, how the picture looks. So, it just looks really blurry. <laughs> I like how you could see the reflection of the camera in the picture. It's blurry. It's really, well, this one might, I was just... And then I was like, let me take a picture of not myself, right? Let me not be, like, so millennial. And it's not so bad. This is a corner of my room that has two frames that I love. And it looks pretty good. This was taken, obviously, in my room with flash. And look how good that looks. Then I went outside and I decided to take a picture of plants and myself. Just because I wanted to see, like, if it really was, you know like a selfie thing and I think it is because these plants look pretty cool I don't I actually don't think this is fully developed this is the most recent picture I took like 10 15 minutes ago so I still I think it's still developing but I took it without flash and maybe it would have looked better if I took it with flash but I still think it looks really cool without it you know it looks really dark and depressing it's just depressing you know and then this is me blurry of course uh, so basically I've come to the conclusion that Polaroid 600 cameras are not meant to take selfies. You could have someone take a picture of you, whatever, but yeah, I feel like the camera, the Polaroids come out really good when you take pictures of something, but when you try to do it of yourself, I don't know. Maybe I haven't mastered it though, that could be it. There's a way to take pictures, to take selfies with a Polaroid 600 and not have it look bad. So there is one more picture that I want to take, but I'm going to have to wait a couple of hours because I want to take a picture at night. I never took a picture at night with a Polaroid, so I'm going to see how it looks. Maybe I'll take two. Flash, well, I, I think, yeah, I think Flash, you have to take a picture with Flash. Uh, yeah, I'll see you tonight. Much, much, much later. I'm eating dinosaur nuggets with hot sauce. Alright, so good. But it was really hot. So it is 9 p.m. and I was outside about 20 minutes ago in my backyard and I took a picture with flash in the darkness that is night. Uh, you probably can't see me, kind of, sort of. There's light here. Maybe you could see me if I do this. Oh, hey. <laughs> so I took a picture of the plants during the day as you saw earlier in the video and I was like well there's nothing else that's cute to take pictures of in my yard like literally there's nothing else so I just had to take a picture of those plants again unless you wanted to see a picture of me which by the way I actually did take a <laughs> I did take another selfie I just I had to and I'm not gonna show you because it, it's bad it's blurry it looks stupid I look ugly blah 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 this is it and it looks good um, yeah the exposure was normal it was in the middle and I just took it with flash and that is the result and that looks pretty good if you ask me also you know what's really weird so the film that I buy from Polaroid like literally the only film that you could use is the Polaroid 600 film there's eight like Polaroids in there and for some reason the camera tells me that I have three left when I literally took seven pictures I took five earlier today and I took two just now and it's telling me that I have three left. I don't know. It's supposed to say one. And then I was like, well, maybe that's how many pictures I took, but that doesn't make any sense because I took seven. So I don't know why it says three. So either the camera is messed up or there's 10 films in that Polaroid pack thing that I bought. So that is the end of this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I'll see you in the next video. If you're watching still, I will show you, I will show you the selfie.